Yes, yeah, I'm a co-op student. There was a job listing on our university job bank. So I applied and I was really excited to get my offer. Yeah, pretty excited about that, you know. <laughs> like, Especially with such a huge company, like, wow. I've heard such great things about it. To be able to make it there was a very uh, exciting feeling. The first day in Mishnah was kind of um, a lot of machine. And... There's so many different cogs and wheels in the whole process. So many tires. Building a tire is complicated. They throw a ton of information at you. Teach us what are the rules and how to work safely. It's recognized as one of the safest employees in Canada. I mean, I even got a fire extinguisher training, you know? Yeah. I got a free pair of work boots. Blundstones are very nice. My favorite pair of goes a little zigzag in the middle. <laughs> if you ever down there, go with that one. What I like about Michelin in general is that no one calls you a co-op student. No one treats you as a student. We are all treated equally. And they're always willing to support you. Everyone gets a mentor. Oh yes, my first mentor is Matthew. Javier, he's great. Justin, Ryan, Mustafa. There's Riley. Tyler, Benoit. Craig. There's Cody, there's Donna, Catherine, and there's Bill. I think I have a lot of mentors. <laughs> They let you make mistakes. It's not dangerous ones. They don't really expect me to know everything. And you said if at the end of the day you have learned something, that's the reason why you are here. You get off 3 o'clock, 3.30, get to enjoy the rest of your day. Yeah, there's definitely a life outside of work. It's a quiet place and I love quiet place. Michelin provided accommodation. That's one of the biggest headaches avoided. <laughs> and pay is great, especially considering that they are giving you the house. And yeah, it's really competitive. It's in Benafer. There's no traffic. You know, you can actually wake up before work by 15 minutes and you'll make it on time. It's definitely an advantage for students, 100%. So my favorite thing to do at Michelin... Volunteering. <laughs> I participated in a lot of events. We had a Michelin float for the Lobster Carnival Parade. Giving candies to people and it was really nice. I volunteered for the junior bike event. I got to interact with all the kids and ask them questions about bike safety. Everyone was happy, it was great. We volunteered to pick up garbage on the highways. And we collected 134 bags. And we were just, I think, 20 people. Ils ne veulent pas juste prétendre que voilà, ils s'en sentent vraiment concernés par le respect de, de l'environnement. They have a mission to send no waste to a landfill by 2030. There's a water filtration. Everything's treated before it's released to the main river out there. And even some earplugs are plant-based now. I always would go around and talk to operators. Getting to know how the plant works. Asking questions, it's the only way you learn. I was like, this is a very cool machine. Let me ask about this part there. What does this do? Donc oui, je sais, j'ai encore plein, plein de choses à apprendre. Go to the lab, test stuff, build stuff. Design it from the ground up. And I saw the design that I was working on during my co-op implemented in front of my eyes and I was really happy. I feel like I have accomplished something because there is something there. Be able to go to the machine and go, that's mine. So it's pretty cool, which is something that I wouldn't ever expect at such a big company. It's not like any other place. Probably the best co-op experience you can have. Michelin helped me when I go back to school. Pretty much everything a co-op student can ask for. This is where I see myself. Try your best to get a co-op position at Michelin. Go for it. There's really no reason why you shouldn't. My favorite part? I don't know yet. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.